A special thank you to each of our subscribers who make this channel possible. Here's today's story. Early Thursday morning, for private astronauts circling far above Earth will try something daring let all the air out of their spacecraft. That will be a prelude for two of the astronauts, who will then venture outside for the first commercial spacewalk ever, an event that is to be the highlight of the Polaris Dawn mission led by Jared Isaacman, a billionaire entrepreneur. When is the spacewalk and how can I watch it? The spacewalk is scheduled to begin at 2.23 a.m. Eastern Time. SpaceX plans to broadcast live coverage starting one hour before the spacewalk begins. If needed, a backup opportunity is available on Friday at the same time. What will happen during the spacewalk? Because there is no airlock in the SpaceX Crew Dragon spacecraft used for the flight, the only way to perform a spacewalk is to let all the air out of the spacecraft and then open one of the hatches. That requires all four crew members to wear spacesuits die in what marks a milestone for the future of commercial space travel. The crew of SpaceX's Crew Dragon Resilience will step outside their spacecraft on Thursday morning for the first ever private spacewalk. Part of the wider Polaris program, the flight is the first of three planned missions spearheaded by billionaire Jared Isaacman in conjunction with SpaceX. After launching from the John F. Kennedy Space Center on Tuesday, the four-person crew of Polaris Dawn entered an elliptic orbit that took them 870 miles from Earth, the furthest a human has reached since the last flight of NASA's Apollo program in 1972.2 crew members are now suiting up in preparation for a two-hour spacewalk outside the Dragon capsule. In what will be the first extravehicular activity conducted by a non-governmental crew in history, AS the crew steps out of their spacecraft and into the vacuum of space, they will make history by pushing the boundaries of what private space missions can achieve. Here is how audiences can be part of the historic mission. What time is the spacewalk? The spacewalk, or extravehicular activity, is scheduled to start at 5.58 a.m. Eastern Time. However, SpaceX cautioned that, should there be any delays or issues, the crew will have a backup opportunity to conduct the walk on Friday, September 13. How to watch the spacewalk? A live webcast of the mission will begin an hour before the spacewalk, and will be streamed on both the SpaceX website and SpaceX's X page. Audiences from around the world can also witness the historic event on live streams hosted by a number of YouTube channels. Who is taking part in the spacewalk? Billionaire Jared Isaacman, 41, and SpaceX crew trainer Sarah Gillis, 30, are set to open the forward hatch of the Polaris Dawn spacecraft on Thursday morning. After this, they will take turns venturing outside, marking the first-ever spacewalk conducted by a non-government crew in the history of space. Exploration Isaac Mann, an American entrepreneur and pilot, previously commanded the Inspiration 4 spaceflight again using the SpaceX Crew Dragon Resilience. Per SpaceX's Polaris mission overview, Mission Commander Jared Isaac Mann will exit Dragon, perform a series of mobility tests in the newly designed SpaceX EVA suit, and return to Dragon's cabin. He will be followed by Sarah Gillis, an American engineer and senior space operations engineer at SpaceX. Mission specialist Sarah Gillis will perform the same series of actions and, after re-entering Dragon, close the spacecraft's hatch, SpaceX said. During the spacewalk, mission pilot Kid Poteet and mission specialist and medical officer Anna Menon will remain in the spacecraft and monitor the operation. What does this mean for the future of space travel? During the walk, the crew will test SpaceX's next-generation spacesuit, designed to provide protection and functionality in the extreme environment of space. The data collected from these tests will inform future missions, including those that aim to venture beyond low-Earth orbit to destinations like the Moon and Mars. The results could pave the way for safer, more efficient spacewalks, considered essential for long-term human space exploration. The mission itself is a key step toward the future of commercial spaceflight, highlighting the increasing role of private companies in advancing space technology. IT demonstrates the growing democratization of space, as private individuals and companies take on roles traditionally held by government space agencies. This mission could inspire a new era of innovation, collaboration, and exploration, with the potential to accelerate humanity's journey into the cosmos. Dio, you have a story we should be covering? Do you have any questions about article? Contact LiveNews at Newsweek.com. Two of Polaris Dawn's four astronauts could make history today by performing the first ever commercial spacewalk at around 700 kilometers, 435 miles, above our planet. Jared Isaacman, the mission leader and funder, 
and SpaceX engineer Sarah Gillis will leave the confines and safety of the sea. That's all for this story. We upload videos every day covering many different subjects, so hit that subscribe button to stay informed. Thanks for watching.